Framo 80 is an innovative modular secondary steel system that has been designed with labour and cost savings in mind. The system can be used to construct access walkways and stairs, pipe supports, tank stands, cable containment supports, equipment stillage and to substitute conventional welded secondary steel in many other applications. The 80 by 80 box section is formed from 350 grade high quality steel. Due to the nature of the box section, it performs equally in torsional performance, which makes it an extremely versatile member. Some of the benefits of Framo 80 include a fully engineered system, comprehensive design and engineering support services, and no requirement for hot works. All components are hot dip galvanized, vibration proof connections with light member weights, which eliminates the need for cranes in most applications. It is a basic system with minimal number of components, which is very user friendly, quick and easy to install. Sickler Systems Australia has an extensive range of components which complement the Framo system. Safety is paramount. Therefore, we recommend that the following safety precautions are taken. Framo 80 is a lightweight product. In many applications, the product can be installed by one person. But to reduce the risk of injury, the aid of a co-worker should be used when required. Steel cap safety boots are crucial. Safety glasses and earmuffs will help protect your eyes and ears. You're now ready to install Framo 80. Framo 80 is an extremely versatile modular secondary steel system. Whilst there are many variations of Sickler components, the Framo 80 system remains extremely compact and user friendly. Three dimensional framing can easily be achieved with the use of just a few components. Let's have a look at some of the common components and connections. The self forming screw is used for all connections on Framo 80. The screw is equipped with a 17mm hex head externally and torque 50 internally for areas with limited access. WBD base plates and TKO beam brackets both have the ability to be bolted to masonry or clamped to the flange of existing steelwork with the use of an assembly set. Clamping to the flange of existing steelwork means that all hot works can be avoided. Hot works could break the protective coating on the existing steel and can even affect the structural integrity. Watch how quickly and easily this connection can be achieved. The bolts of the assembly sets require tightening to a specific torque. Set P2 requires 85 Newton meters of torque and set P3 requires 150 Newton meters of torque. Sickler Systems Australia recommends putting in a test screw first and checking that the torque achieved has not exceeded 60 Newton meters. A maximum 10 mm gap should be achieved from the end of the Framo 80 section to the top of the base plate. Sickler Systems Australia recommends using an 8 mm gap as this gives a small margin for misalignment and one can use any of the staff connections to achieve this. Insert the screw at a maximum spacing achievable. The insertion of the screws is effortless with the use of a rattle gun. The screw must be driven in all the way and rattled until the connection is tight. Repeat the process on the opposite side. A maximum of 60 Newton meters torque is to be applied to the screw. Pivot joints are connected in the same way, except the gap from the Framo 80 section to the end of the pivot joint should be 13 millimeters. In this example, we'll be constructing a basic frame to demonstrate how efficient and flexible the system can be. To begin, bolt the WBD base plates to the concrete pads. There are many different types of masonry anchors available. 
In this demonstration, we've opted to use chemical anchors. Once you have secured the base plates, slide on the vertical columns. Set a gap of 10 millimetres or less from the end of the section to the top of the base plate. The Staff 80 range of connections are ideal as spacers because they are 8 millimetres thick. Insert the self-forming Framo screws through the slots of the Framo section into the hole of the connector behind, as detailed in the previous chapter. End caps simply knock into place. The end cap will conceal any burrs from the cut end and highlight the corners of the frame for added safety. Now that the vertical columns are complete, let's have a look at the horizontal beams. By using staff ADE connections, we can achieve a flush finish between our beams and columns. Remember to put the Framo screws as far apart as possible. Assemble the Staff ADE connection to the beam, ensuring accurate screw placement and gaps. The beam can now be bolted securely to the columns with the aid of a co-worker. Now your frame is complete. One of the common uses for a frame such as this is for access walkways and platforms. Sickler Systems Australia offers many options for flat pack access walkways and platforms. One of these options include three types of grid mesh, galvanised steel, aluminium and fibreglass. There is also mono wheels handrail and modular handrail available. In this example, we'll install fibreglass grid mesh and stair treads. In the next chapter, we'll demonstrate how to install modular handrail. Firstly, place the grid mesh on the previously constructed frame. The grid mesh is secured by placing the M clips on the grid mesh and passing the bolts supplied through the beam section. Finally, install the nut and washer and tighten. Stairs can easily be constructed out of frame 080. Pivot joints are used to form the stair stringers. Ensure a 13mm gap is achieved as detailed in Chapter 2. Once the stringer is assembled, secure the upper pivot joint to the column, ensuring the pivot joint is flush with the top of the frame. The lower pivot joint can then be bolted to the concrete pads. Lastly, tighten the pivot joint bolts. Stair treads are fitted to the stringers by using stair tread adapters. Install the first stair tread adapter flush with the top of the frame. Once you have installed the first stair tread adapter, complete the process for the remainder. The spacing between the adapters will be outlined in your job specific instructions. Mm -hmm. 
stair treads can now be placed on the adapters and secured with M clips with the bolts provided. We will now demonstrate how to install the modular handrail. The first step is to secure the handrail adapters to the frame. The layout of the handrail adapters will be outlined in your job specific instructions. Now install the flange fittings to the handrail adapters. Handrail adapters for the stairs are bolted to the top of the stringer. Now, install the flange fittings to the adapters once again. Insert the pre-cut staunchions into the flange fittings and then tighten the grub screws firmly. The grub screws will bite into the tubing ensuring a solid connection. Next, install the mid rails as shown. The top rail is installed by sliding the tube through the T-joints. Stair transitions are a breeze with the versatile modular handrail system.
In this chapter, we'll demonstrate how to incorporate accessories such as cantilever brackets, slide sets, pipe clamps, and show you a few basic Framo designs. Sickler have a large range of versatile products which complement the Framo 80 range. Sickler strut cantilever brackets are a great way to support pipe work and cable trays. Simply install the cantilever bracket using two self-forming screws. Pipework can easily be supported by utilising block sets and pipe clamps. Cable trays can be secured to cantilever brackets by inserting a speed nut and securing the bolt. The unique speed nut will bring about great efficiencies in your workflow. Using the Framo cantilever brackets is a great way to support pipes and equipment where large load carrying capacities are required. Simply place the cantilever bracket in the desired location and lock off with four self-forming screws. Sickler Systems Australia offers many different options for slide sets to combat expansion and contraction in pipework. Let's have a look at a few of them. One of the alternatives to slide sets is to use mounting plates. Sickler Systems Australia is highly experienced in providing turnkey project solutions that are quick to install for many industrial applications. Feel free to contact us to find out how we can provide you with an easy solution to benefit your business and save you time and money.